Um, and we're live. We are live. Hey, this is Robbie Henderson with Travis Bell of the Bell Henderson team. We are live on our weekly Thursday at 4 p.m. We are trying to come to you every week live from the listing, and this one we're really excited to share with you. We are. This is in Palmasia, the heart of South Tampa. We're at one of our awesome townhome projects. We've got about 14 units here that are available. Yeah. 14 available and uh, 10 of them are going to be available in the next six weeks to two months. Awesome. So we're going to kind of take you through something that's not quite ready, but it's almost there. So take a look at our uh, balcony while we're out here. So uh, while we're up here on the top floor, it's a little windy, a little noisy. So give us a thumbs up if you can hear us okay in the comments. Kelly exactly. gave us a thumbs up. All right, sweet. I'm here with the with the guys too. So don't think they forgot me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so up here on the balcony, you can see that we have nice artificial turf, which is uh, number one, you don't really have balconies in South Tampa too much, but two, you do have actually somewhat of a lawn on top of your uh, your townhome, so it's really cool. And it is pet friendly, and you know. You can do. All right, well, let's go inside. You know what, though? You guys, they should leave us a comment down below. What would you guys use this rooftop terrace space for? Hi, Valencia. I think lots of entertaining. Did we get the views of downtown? We did. Did you see those views from downtown? Look at that. Sweet. Oh, we can't right. zoom on your phone, too. Okay. Now you're in a really cool <laughs> All right, so this is an air-conditioned space on the fourth floor. So this area here, remember we're under construction, so use your vision. This is going to be a wet bar area up here. You can kind of see how it's marked out. Yep, with the sink, we're going to have a little refrigerator up here. You can put some chairs up here, a TV, whatever you want. So it's kind of a cool space. Lots of fun up here. Lots of fun. All right, Hi, Nalesh. We're going to take you down to the main living area where the bedrooms are, so that would be the third floor. And we have to tell you, we are so excited. This We just got air conditioning, literally today or yesterday, which is getting us all excited because that means that they can now cure the wood floors and get everything prepared and make things which, which know, go fast. Wood floors are going in this week and next unit week. Six, so. Yeah, unit yeah. six are going in right now. This unit will have wood floors by next week. So this is the master bedroom. And you'll see how good the size of the room is. Take a look at the uh, I'm going to spin around a little bit here. All right. All right. So we've got the closet over here. Notice the insulated windows, no noise, impact windows. Huge, deep closet. Go and check out. And then 12 by 24 tiles. His and her sink. The high sinks. They even got the fancy uh, toilets. <laughs> What's that called? And the, the, the fancy shower heads? Yeah. Fancy toilets. I guess I gotta show the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> So this is his closet. The first closet was her closet. Which is much larger. So we've got 25, 38 square feet in these townhomes, three bedrooms, three and a half baths, upstairs laundry, which Robbie is pointing out. Super and a secondary convenient. bedroom. With an ensuite bath, which is nice. And that. Nice uh, toilet thrones. <laughs> <laughs> but very nicely done. Post a question if you have any questions for us in the comments. Also, we forgot to mention at the very beginning, we're going to be having um, another contest. So if you saw last week's Facebook Live feed, you would know that we had a contest last week. And this is actually our fifth Facebook Live feed in a row. Um, so, stay tuned until the end for more contest information. So take a look at all this space. You got a really nice size break room living area, obviously a huge kitchen and then a dinette area, a 
Another nice feature is they do have outdoor balconies and then a half bath on this floor. So as you said, Travis, this is just one floor of common space. He's still here, Robbie. Sorry, I'm walking away. <laughs> yeah, so this whole floor is a nice um, open concept of all common space. So another cool thing about this community um, is that we have a pool as well. So anyone buying in here would have access to a community pool, um, which is right around the corner. Hi, Julie. Nalesh says, looking nice. It is looking nice. Thank you for the comment. So we've got these pendant lights too. We've got great countertops here, solid wood cabinets. These are nice. Ton of cabinet space, bunch of uppers, lowers on this side. Here, I'll come by to the other yeah. side. Hi, Julie. So I'm assuming that's going to be the dishwasher. Dishwasher. Next week, we'll <laughs> uh, take some pictures with the wood in. Be nice. Notice this will be gas and then this will be a hood only. So it's going to have a really nice decor to it. Yes. Awesome. Crown molding under and above. Cool. Let's go see the downstairs and maybe poke into the next unit real quick. Julie yeah. says, Love the tile backsplash. Thanks, Julie. Walking down to the first floor, there's your main entrance. So Ashley, if, if anyone watching live um, has somebody they would think this is a good fit for, what should they do? They should uh, tag that person down below in the comments. That'd be great. All right, so while we're still in the unit, this we would tell you you could use as the third bedroom for the full bath or as a downstairs office. And as you're looking off of here, you're going to notice that everybody's got a really nice front yard. And that, you know, we're going to tell you a little bit more as time goes along. But you would definitely have a little area to take your dog out and, you know, let him do his business. Or if you want to do some barbecuing, you can do that out there. We'll look at it from there. So. Nice, nice little closet, full bath here, attached, which is nice. So knowing that this place has... Well, not this place, but this downstairs first floor room has its own ensuite bath. Would you use this space as a guest room or an office space? Leave us a comment down below. So another cool feature is the attached two-car garage. Which is our favorite part as men, that you actually have the ability to put two cars in this two-car garage. And it could be an SUV or one of the big old trucks because this thing is 25 feet long. I think is, this truck proves that, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Which, Robbie, is that longer or shorter than typical garages? Well, typical, I mean, they count an 18 by 18 as a two-car garage. So we're telling you that a 20 by 20, this is not. This is at least 24 by 25. Which is really nice size. You can notice it when you see the block on either side. You can see that there's plenty of store, storage and all that. So, but come on out to the front because again, the nice part is you're going to park you in the back now. and we'll come out this way. Heidi says, I hear that area has some really great neighbors too. Hi, Travis. Yes. Travis just went to go let us into the next unit. So the other but. neat part about it is, and Travis can tell you a little bit more about it, but this is in the Mitchell Wilson Plant District. So you are truly in Colosseo. We are three blocks from Sally O'Neill's, and right there you can walk to Burns from here. You can walk to Colosseo Country Club that way. And look who's greeting us now at unit number nine. Thanks, Travis. So I didn't miss your comment, Kelly. I saw your comment. She says, do all the units have the same color cabinets? And actually that is why we're here in unit number nine. So take them into that bedroom, or are we going to just go upstairs? Yeah, we're just going to take you upstairs, but it's a similar floor plan as the last uh, unit that we showed you, but the main difference you'll see when we go upstairs to the kitchen area. So, so does, well, does anybody notice a difference? <laughs> Robbie? This is, this is your comment to make. What is that? If white, you, white, and bright? If you don't like the white cabinets and the gray countertops, <laughs> you can have 
the gray cabinets with the white countertops. <laughs> and honestly, guys, we are so blessed to work with this developer. Uh, we did a project with them off of McDill, and I have to tell you that my favorite part about dealing with them is their contractors were amazing. When they came to the punch out list, when they came to finishing the product, nobody complained. Nobody was upset. They were just really, really first class and just they warrant their stuff and they're just awesome to deal with. They have a huge pride of craftsmanship and I, yeah. I think it shows through with every single town home we sell for them. So whoever buys this is gonna get a great quality home with you know um, some kind of peace of mind knowing that you have just a great quality home and a great location. And I would just tell you lastly, the price of the units are somewhere around six seventy five, six seventy nine. dollars uh, The maintenance fee is going to be around $300 a month. That includes the pool. There are a couple of units that were uh, left over from an original development, and our developer has graciously enough uh, offered to paint and fix those units to match our decor. So we are so fired up to be a part of this. So two cool, last uh, two cool things about this place. Number one, it's located in AAA rated school districts. So you've got Mitchell, Wilson, and Plant, all the fantastic schools. And how far are we off of uh, Howard? Three blocks. Three blocks off of Howard. So Sally O'Neill's and Bella's. Yeah, and then and Fresh Kitchen. And, and then what's that big thing uh, about five blocks away that runs along the water? What's that called? I wouldn't know it. It's, yeah, it's called Bayshore. <laughs> <laughs> Lose this more than I do. <laughs> so Mayshore Boulevard is like literally five blocks away. Run, bike, whatever you want to do. Walk your dog, have fun. Yeah. And Palmacia Park is maybe like five blocks in the other direction. So yeah, they've got dogs. a dog park there. They've got kid stuff. Seriously, there's not a better location. Yeah. I mean, this, this is, is the most park. central place in the world. New suburb, Palmacia Country Club. It's just fire. It fires you up to be able to be here. So, actually, any other questions from the audience? Um. I don't have any questions, but oh, I, oh. I want to tell you, um, so as you can see, these units are going to be ready in the next four to six weeks. So if you'd like to come, we're going to have a real nice party on one of those rooftop decks, and we're going to invite all of our uh, sphere and clients and realtors. So if you would like to be invited and you'd like to come see it for either A, a personal visit, or B, the little cocktail power party we're doing, put your name in there, and we will invite you. So if you want to check out more information about this particular project, we have an easy website for you to go to. It's called belfairliving.com. That's B-E-L-F-A-I-R living.com. Yes. So, and actually, what I did have one more thing. Oh, okay. um, but... <laughs> more, I have to flip the camera myself so that way I'm not a little blind eye. <laughs> but... Um, so as mentioned in the beginning, we are running another contest for all you viewers. And this time around, in order to be entered, you need to share this video. And when you share it, put hashtag Belle Henderson team. Oh, Kelly says she wants to come to the party. <laughs> yeah, not, not those her. of us that don't know what a hashtag is. <laughs> so hashtag is the number sign if you didn't know. <laughs> But yeah, so if you want to be entered into the contest, share this video, like our page, and put hashtag Bell Henderson team, and we will enter you into our contest. And we will announce the winner tomorrow at 12 o'clock with another uh, Facebook live feed. So you have until tomorrow, Friday, what day is tomorrow? Friday, October 5th, I think. Sounds good. <laughs> Whichever day of the week it is <laughs> at 12 p.m. So, so Ashley, why don't we do another Facebook Live here in like three or four weeks? Check yeah. on the progress. Does that sound good? Yes. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So since this project is ongoing, it's not complete yet, we will check in here at least once a month and let you guys know how this place is going. Awesome. Moving along. Thank you guys for joining. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. See you guys Bye. in the next video.